All right. So Jaleel uh, Penner asks, what is the best way to advertise when dealing with variations by size, specifically in the mattress category? Um, I have it separated by size right now in terms of keyword bidding strategy. Okay. So um, two things to cover. Size specific keywords. Number one, it, you know, take, take all of your keywords that, uh, that have any sizes at all. And they should only target the size uh, variation. So mm -hmm. if it's queen, any keyword that has the word queen in it should, should like when, when you create the campaign, the only skew that you're adding in there, the only variation is the queen. Now, second, what about all the general stuff? Mattress stopper, this, that, that are very, very broad. Uh, you know, um, what I would do is I would take all of the keyword, all of the uh, uh, sizes and put them in the campaign. So let's say it's, you know, you have a mattress stopper uh, campaign, uh, you know, with the mattress stopper keyword, add all of your variations, run it and wait, wait, like, let's say two, three, four weeks, and then go and look at the, like, when you click on the campaign, the first tab is going to say ads, it's going to show you all of your different variations and their performance, the number of impressions they've gotten, click through rate, conversion rate, uh, uh, ROAS, sales, all of these different things. I suggest the the keyword with the best click through rate or the best uh, uh, sales. You uh, sorry, not the keyword, the ASIN, the the variation with the best click through rate or the best sales. That's the one that you keep running. So you mm. pause the other ones and you keep that one running. What's going to happen is when someone uh, uh, types in mattress stopper, they're going to show the variation that that based on history and based on data is the most likely to convert. This applies to all uh, uh, variations, like all like products with variations is, uh, you know, if it's, if it's a variation specific keyword only advertise that variation, uh, but if it's a broad keyword that can like, let's say it's something and you have five different flavors, it's a protein powder, you have chocolate, mm -hmm. vanilla, you know, chocolate, peanut butter. What are you going to do in that case? Whichever flavor starts driving the best click through rate, which means it sends the most traffic to, to your listing, try advertising only that one. And again, it's going to be a test, right? So you're looking at your results from that campaign and then you're going to pause the variations and keep the best one in your opinion and then look at the new results. And if the new results are better, good. If the old results are better, turn things back on and, and you know, maybe test a different uh, ASIN. Awesome. 